Yo guys, welcome back. And in today's tutorial, I'll be showing you how to create this grunge distortion lens effect to use in your next edit or music video. Starting off, I already have two clips right here. And the first thing I'm gonna do is make an adjustment layer. Then I'm gonna go ahead and add S underscore distort chroma. It is part of a paid plugin. There's ways you guys can get it for action free. I can't say how, just doing research. Um, and uh, just be careful when you're looking at looking around on the internet, doing research because you could get a virus. So yeah, beware, but there's ways to get it for free. So yeah, um, I'm gonna bring up our blur lens around to like a thousand, then bring down our amount to around like 140, close this out. And we already got something like this. It's kind of like a chromatic aberration effect. So I'm going to close this out. Then go ahead and add S underscore hotspots. And actually, depending on your own clip, if it's light or dark, um, your actual hotspots effect could look different. So if I were you, just go and add um, an exposure effect. And uh, just mess around with your clip. So if I were to have it too light, you can obviously tell it looks way different. So like what I said, let's go and mess around with it and see what you can come up with. You just want to get something close to kind of like this. So I'm going to close this out and then I'm going to go ahead and add noise. Go down here and drag a noise. Turn off our color noise and bring up our noise to around, to around like 30. Then close this out. Make another new adjustment layer. Then we're going to go to our user presets. I'm going to go to the Grand Anarchy pack. And if you guys don't know, um, I actually did release my first editing pack. It's called the Grunge Anarchy Pack. And if you guys are interested in like Grunge aesthetic or just adding a new Grunge vibe to your videos, I recommend checking out the pack. It comes with over 40 effects ranging from CRT effects to Grunge essential effects to even Grunge flicker effects to use in your next edit music video. So I'm going to go here to our Grunge pack, open it up, go to Grunge flicker essentials. I'm going to head to the beginning of our video right here. Then I'm going to go to chromatic burn flicker. I'm going to select it and you can already tell, I mean, dude, this looks awesome. <laughs> he gives off a crazy chromatic, like white and black um, effect, but I'm going to turn off our colorama since our colorama is giving us that nice black and white effect. Then I'm going to open up our timeline, get rid of this little keyframe at the end. Then I'm going to highlight all these right here. Then I'm going to copy and paste it. Just like that, we get a nice flickering effect throughout the whole video. And yeah, um, just like that, it shows you the real power of this preset pack within what a couple seconds and with some minor changes. I just completely transform my footage from or turn this off from this right here, which is is already a nice effect, to something like this. And if you are interested in buying this pack, it's gonna be in the link in the description below. It's called the Grand Anarchy Pack once again. And make sure to use code YT5 to have a $5 discount once you decide to buy the pack. Hope you guys enjoyed today's tutorial. If you did, go ahead and like, subscribe, or even leave a comment on what you guys want to see next. Keep on staying creative and keep on working hard. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out.